In this video, we'll give a full review of the American Express High Yield Savings Account, which is one of the best savings accounts out there, as it offers a high APY with a ton of flexibility. Feel free to pause the video to read the disclaimer or find the full disclaimer in the video description below. With the Amex High Yield Savings Account, you can currently earn 4.25% APY on the money you keep in your account, which is a solid rate, especially compared to the APY you'll get with traditional savings accounts, which is often as low as 0.01% APY at banks like Chase and Bank of America. The high APY you earn with this account will fluctuate along with the market, and the rate will usually change a bit a few times a year. For example, the APY for the Amex High Yield Savings Account was 4.35% earlier this year, and it dropped down to 4.3% and then 4.25% a few months ago. While there are high yield savings accounts with lesser known banks that offer some higher rates, American Express is a popular bank that's been around for a long time that many people are familiar with, so it's a really good option for anyone that's new to high yield savings accounts. The interest you earn also compounds daily and will be deposited into your account on a monthly basis. What makes this account super flexible and a great high yield savings account for beginners is that the account has no minimum opening deposit, no minimum balance requirements, and no monthly maintenance fees. In other words, you can open the account with a few dollars if you like, and if you need to dip into the money that's in your account, you can do so without incurring any charges, even if your balance goes down to just a few dollars. Although there isn't a minimum balance required, you'll have to fund your account within 60 days of your application being approved or your account will be closed, and you'll want to keep at least a couple dollars in the account at all times as well. In addition, direct deposit is not required to earn the high APY. Amex doesn't have a sign-up bonus for their high-yield savings account right now, but they do occasionally offer targeted bonuses for it, so it's always good to keep an eye out if there's one available when you're about to open your account. It's also good to note that many high-yield savings accounts don't offer sign-up bonuses or other promotions, since they're already offering really high rates on your account balance. Of course, the Amex high-yield savings account is also FDIC insured, which covers $250,000 per depositor, per insured bank, per account ownership category. So the account is just as safe as any traditional bank account. You can open this savings account online, which takes just a few minutes. Since American Express is an online bank, they don't have physical branches you can visit, and you won't get an ATM or debit card for this savings account, which means you won't be able to deposit or withdraw cash from ATMs. So, like most other high-yield savings accounts, this account is best used alongside a traditional checking and savings account with a brick-and-mortar bank like Chase or Bank of America, where you can deposit or withdraw cash from a branch or ATM. Even though Amex doesn't have physical branches, you can still reach their customer service team 24-7 to answer any questions you have or handle issues with your account. To make cash deposits or withdrawals, you'll need to do so at a brick and mortar bank you belong to that allows customers to deposit or withdraw cash at an ATM or branch and do an online transfer between that traditional bank account and your American Express savings account. Outside of transferring money online between your Amex account and another linked bank account you have, you can also do mobile check deposits with this account. And you can also set up direct deposit to deposit money directly into your Amex savings account every time you get paid as well. It's also important to note that this account doesn't support Zelle transfers. American Express also doesn't charge overdraft fees for this account, which is great. Bear in mind, it can take a few days for your funds to transfer between your Amex savings account and your other linked bank account if you do an online transfer. It can take between 1 and 5 days for your funds to show up, depending on whether you're pushing or pulling funds. There is also no limit to the number of withdrawals and transfers you can make from your Amex savings account. American Express offers a great basic high yield savings account that's easy to open and maintain for the long term, with a high APY and no minimum balance requirements or monthly fees. It's a great account to consider if you're looking for a high yield savings account for beginners or for one that offers a ton of flexibility with no direct deposit or minimum balance required in order to earn the high APY. It's a great place to keep your savings if you want to earn passive income on your money while being able to dip into it at any time if you need it. So it's a great place to put things like your emergency fund. I've personally had this account for a few years now and it's been great so far. If you're looking for another high yield account that offers higher rates, there are options like the SoFi High Yield Savings Account, which currently offers 4.6% APY on your account balance if you're able to set up direct deposit to the account and there's no minimum dollar amount in direct deposit required. Plus it offers a solid sign up bonus as well. You can learn more about the SoFi account in this video here. If you're looking for even higher rates, there are other FDIC insured accounts with lesser 
lesser known banks, which do offer APYs on the higher end of the spectrum, which is currently around the 5% range. If you want to learn more about those accounts, we have a video on some of the main high yield savings accounts that offer higher APYs here. Let me know in the comments, do you have the Amex High Yield Savings account or are you thinking of getting it? If you enjoyed this video, you may be interested in this video next, where we go over the top 9 credit cards that earn 5% cashback with no annual fees, or this video, where we give a full review of the Discovery Cashback card. If you found this video helpful, it'd be a huge help if you could click like and subscribe if you haven't yet. It really helps get our videos out to more people to help them save money and it's totally free. If you want to be notified when we post new videos, don't forget to click the notification bell as well. Thanks for watching and see you next time.